Hi guys, this is the baritone video for Tongo. Um, let's just go through um, how to pronounce it and the history of the song. And then we are gonna, I'm gonna break it down for you so you can understand how some of the clapping and stuff fits together. And then we'll go through the whole song. You guys definitely have the most complicated part in this um, song, just because you switch from being the leaders and then the echoers sometimes. And you, um, you also have some harmony in here too. So. Um, first of all, let's work on the history. So Tongo, which means mangrove, is a traditional canoe song from the Solomon Islands in Polynesia. Its echo format of mostly nonsense syllables are meant to illustrate people communicating from canoe to canoe as they travel between the islands. So that's why there's echoing in this song. Let's pronounce it. Please repeat after me. Tongo. Jimni bai bai yo. Umba de Kimbayo Uale Male Kalo Way. Okay, now the clapping pattern that goes along with Tongo sounds like this Tita, Tita, Tita. Ready? Go. Tita, Tita, Tita. Okay, it's actually the rhythm of the words Umba de Kimbayo. Okay. And it comes after Tongo like this. Tongo. So what you do once you get to the go part, you count one, two in your head, and then you start the clapping like this. Tongo. One, two, ti ta, ti 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 ta. Ready? Try it. Here you go. Tongo. One, two, ti ta, ti 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 ta. Okay. And then there's um, another clapping that goes with Male Callaway. And that's just single eighth notes. And your where you start putting, or excuse me, they're single quarter notes. <laughs> and where you put those clapping um, happens at different times. So you're just gonna have to listen with me because it's not consistent. I can't tell you which one or the other, okay? Um, I'm gonna sing, I'm gonna play um, down the octave for you, but I'm gonna sing personally up the octave so you can decide which one you feel more comfortable with. The lowest note we hit in this song is this. If you can't sing that, that's okay. You can just emit that note and sing everything else you can. For the tongo part, if you wanna sing up the octave with me up here, tongo, or you can sing down the octave. The other parts I'd like you to try to sing as written, okay? So again, I'll play with you, but I'm going to be singing up the octave in my register. And if that's where you feel comfortable, then you can join me. Ready, set, here we go. Tongo. Tongo. Now we echo.
over just a couple things. Um, I forgot to tell you in the beginning, but you might've noticed that the blue is you guys. So you're following the blue flower throughout this entire song. Okay. I just want to go over that. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. It's um, a different rhythm entirely. So it goes like this. We do it four times. Ta -ta -ta. If you want to go like this. That's going to be a little easier for us, but if you, if you can get down here, that's great too. Let's try it. Ready? Here we go. Tango, tango. Tango, tango. Tango, tango. Tango, tango. Okay, so we echo there and then the ending notes are different so we do two tongos one clapping pattern in the middle and then we get into the ending so here's the ending and then we do it again that's your ending note like this Sing it up there with me or sing it down here. Okay. One more time, and here's the clapping. One more time, let's add the tongos with it. Two tongos, one clapping in the middle. And it's back to normal. Tongo. the link to this practice video underneath my video on my channel so that you can um, go ahead and practice it without the lagging that's happening with